So we're going to set up a camper trailer to show you how it all works, from the bed flies to the annex, um, right through it all, and then winding down the legs. So we'll start and we'll go from there. So we'll start by undoing the four clips all the way around. And that holds the top down. Okay, now we're going to stabilise the, the uh, camper. So on this particular model, has got the drop down legs. So by pulling out the red handle there, the leg will drop straight down. And now I'll just get the winder out the front boot. By placing the winder onto the, the nut, then continue to wind down. <clears throat> Once the foot reaches the ground, just make it firm and that'll stop the van, that'll stabilise the van and stop it from moving around. And we need to do that in all four legs. Okay, next we'll take the winder handle. And this winds up the van. By opening up the little flap there, the handle slides in. And now we can start winding up. To wind it up to a height, it's comfortable for you to undo the flies and the awning. So a little bit higher, yeah. And now just go around and undo them. Now by unzipping the awning, all the way around to the end, just let that come down. Half the undo the bill. Just let, let that wind down to the ground like that. And the same with the bed flies. Just undo the tab there and let them roll down. And also the poles are also wrapped up in the bed flies. So we'll take them out and just lay them on the A-frame there. And then we'll continue to wind the camper up. Okay, once you're winding up to a certain height, check the strap there for the tension on the camper. Continue to wind up until you have about the tension there like that. Then you know you're at the right position. The next thing to do, we'll set up the awning. So we're taking the poles out the front boot and we'll just empty them out on the ground so we can see which ones fit where. So place the pole, you're upright, through the spreader pole and through the hole in the awning. Then put the wing nut up on the top till it's firm. Okay, once you've set up the other three poles, like that, and the wing nuts are on, you have a spring-loaded pole, which the two push together, and there's a spring in that. By placing that one up into the bag, bring that down, and that spring loads into the upright, you'll find a hole there. Okay, once you've done that, straighten the pole up, and adjust your height. And now adjust the other three poles. Okay, now it's just a matter of pegging out the rope in case the wind comes up. So now you just slide out the bed, bring it up onto the roller, and then straight out. Next thing to do is get your bed support poles from under the mattress. Bed support pole goes onto the spike by using your shoulder to lift up, goes into the bracket there. Then grab the canvas and bring that out loosely over the top. Now we're going to set up the bed flies by placing the poles up through the eyelet in the bed fly to there, taking the rope and just placing over the top. Undo the clip there and adjust up and close that down. Just leave that resting there for the moment. Do the same at the other end. Bring the rope out and the eyelet and then hammer into the ground. Straighten the pole up and do the same on the other end. Now you come inside. Underneath the mattress is the hockey stick by placing that onto the bracket there. Push out on the, on the hockey stick. Putting that over like that, 
and now do the same at the other end. And now we're going to fit the annex walls to the bag awning. Well, starting from the front wall, just running that up the track. Okay, and now you've run the wall up the track there. It's simply just by bringing it up and Velcroing it on. And just work your way along. Okay, and that's how easy it is to put up. Okay, so once you've set up the bed ends, it's just a matter of setting up the doors. So start by taking the cover off. The door. Undo the door off the clips. Bring the door down. So it fits on the outside of the door and then the locating pins will drop down into the hole. Then by pushing the door in at the top and doing up the butterfly clips. And now undo the catches and then lock the bottom and the top half of the door together. And then wrap around the canvas by tucking in the, in the groove, work your way up from the bottom up to the top and then just Velcro up from the outside of the van. Just a little hint when you're folding up the canvas, just bring it off the bar, bring it over to the centre. Same on the other end, and then just flip it up. Then take out your bed support poles, place them under the mattress. Same with the other one. By lifting the bed up a little bit, and then just slide in. Check your canvas that it's not getting caught up, and then continue on in.